Hey guys, it's me again. Hair done, nails done like a bad bitch. Don't niggas tell me to a sad bitch. I can't fuck him if he average. And I know I haven't made a video in a very long time, but guess what, guys? This time I'm back for real. Like, I'm not gonna say I'm back and I'll be back for real. Like, I'm really back this time. The reason I wasn't recording is because, you know, I had that crappy iphone 6s and like the quality wasn't good and like my phone had problems like i always had to like have my earphones plugged in so you guys could hear me and stuff and it was just it was just too much work trying to be able to record with that phone so my mom decided to buy me the iphone 11 and now the quality is just so great like i like a whole new person like can't nobody tell me nothing okay back to what's actually important i'm trying to make sure that you guys can like actually see me because i don't okay today i'm gonna be sh i'm okay basically for t this is i'm gonna be rebranding 2020 like my brand is gonna change not like not necessarily like the products but i will be adding new inventory but like i'm not gonna like change like what i sell i was considering changing my name like, because right now it's Noise Meeks. And people kind of think I only sell lashes because it's Noise Meeks. So I was thinking of changing it to Noise Beauty Co. for collection. Because, you know, I'm about to come up with a lot of stuff. But my sister doesn't think I should change the name. So we're just going to leave the name how it is. Plus, I made all new business cards. made thank you cards. And I kept it as Noise Meeks. So I might just keep it like that. Because I honestly don't really feel like redoing these cards. Because it's a lot of work. But that's not what we're talking about right now right now so i've been seeing people using these cute little christmas boxes to make like little christmas packs and currently right now i have a gloss pack i mean i have a lash pack too but it there was no special packaging for it i only made packaging for the lip gloss so i decided to make packaging for the for the um, lash pack too okay so this is how my lip gloss packs look This is gonna be a day in the life. I mean, it's not really a day in the life because, well, that's what I'm gonna name it anyways. So this is what the lip gloss looks like. This one is called Winter Wonderland and it comes with, let me show you the colors. This is literally, this is the one I'm wearing right now. All my glasses sh show up clearish. The one I made for myself, I didn't put as much sparkles in it. So that's why you don't see sparkles on my lip, but when you put it on, it does put like some blue sparkles. So I have, this one's called Cheers, this one's called Snowflake, and it's called Frostbite. And together it makes Winter Wonderland. And then I have, you know, the classical Christmas pack with candy cane, snow white, and regular red. And that's how it looks. So this is the packaging I have for lip gloss. It also comes in squeeze tube forms as well. So today I'm gonna be making my lash packs. And in my lash packs, it's one lash and two glosses for $12. Which is a great price because the lashes is seven dollars and the lip gloss is four dollars each. If you add eight plus seven, what's eight plus seven? Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. That's actually fifteen dollars. So I'm actually giving it cheaper because like if you were to buy the glosses and the lip gloss separately, it would total us fifteen dollars. But I'm giving you the pack for twelve. Beat that. You can't. <laughs> so I got these. I got some candy canes to put inside of the the boxes look cute i got red and white confetti whatever you call it and yeah so it's first come first serve and these will go up on christmas today's the 21st tomorrow's 22nd no today's the 22nd so i think i'm gonna put these up on christmas or maybe i'll put them up tonight i don't really know but the only problem with these boxes are they don't fit inside of my bubble mailers which i didn't really think that through when i bought these i thought they would fit inside the bubble mailers but for some reason it doesn't fit okay so in the mistletoe pack it's the lash style flirt and cheers and snowflake gloss so one pack has squeeze tubes and one pack is wand tubes so how we're gonna set it up is let me get the glosses so it's oh my gosh my label coming off better stick back down because i didn't bring my labels home with me it's cheers and snowflake so these two glosses come together 
with the lash style flirt and this is how the glasses look this one is super sparkly super cute and this one is an orange it's not really orange it's more of a a gold it just oh my god when you put it on it's really cute okay so let me find flirt that's not flirt and i'm gonna show you guys the new business cards and thank you cards i designed and if you want a video on how to design thank you cards and business cards i'll definitely make that for you guys because only if you knew how hard it was for me to make it but i figured it out why well, didn't figure it out i watched this other girl's youtube channel confetti red and white because we got christmas colors this red is not even like a cute red it's kind of ugly i can't fill it up too much because then the last box won't fit inside i'm so i'm guys when i tell you i'm literally rebranding like my products my last box are gonna be different my lip gloss too they're gonna be different because like i like the diamond box like it's really cute but i just feel like packaging wise i literally have to have bigger bubble mailers just to put like lashes in like you get what i'm saying like if i had like the rectangle boxes the these little mailers could fit the lash and a lip gloss but because i have a rectangle I'm not rectangle, because i have a, um, a diamond box i have to literally buy like a bigger mailer just for lashes and that's it's really wasting money because i could just have one size mailer that fits everything and obviously the bigger mailers will be for like way bigger orders but yeah Okay, so I'm mixing the confetti up. I wish I had my tripod so you guys could like really see what I'm doing. That's okay. I know you've guys seen, you've literally seen this trending everywhere. If you like follow lip gloss pages, literally everyone's doing this. So it's not like it's anything brand new or spectacular. But shout out to Bougie Barbie because she was like the first person to do it, I believe. So this is how it looks right now. And then I'm gonna put the lash. And then the lip gloss. Oh, hold up. It's looking kind of cute. And then I got some candy canes to go inside just for, you know, I really wanted chocolate, but I couldn't find like kisses or like the cute chocolates. It was all those, those weird chocolates that like, like who even eats those? Okay, here's how it looks guys. Ta-da. And then put a business card inside. And I'm so mad I got this many business cards and I'm about to change everything. But I'm going to use these business cards for like my school orders and delivery orders. And like the new business cards would be for like, for like, um, outside orders. Because the new business cards I created are just too cute. Like, I don't know if I want to put the business cards inside because it's kind of ruining the style. My side. I think I'm gonna just stick the business card like when I'm done. But for pictures, it's not gonna be in there. And then you close it up. It's better close. Okay, close. And this is how the last pack comes. And when you open it, it'll look like this. Ta-da! With candy canes and lip gloss and lashes at the top. This is cute. I will buy this. So I'm put the lash at the top. I could put the lash at the bottom for this one. But I feel like it's going to move when you ship it, so it doesn't matter. And then they get gloss Snow White in the tube. And Frostbite in the tube. I got this hair from my bed. Okay. That's how it looks. This gloss is so pretty. And I I wish I had chunky glitter so it could, it could look so much cuter. But I just use the glitter I had right now. But I really like it. Okay, and then you put the lip glosses next year well it's not gonna be like immediately next year because i don't go back to school till like almost my birthday which is january 25th if you didn't know on my birthday i would like everyone to purchase something that's all i want for my birthday is to make sales you don't have to do anything else but buy something but yeah this is how it looks but yeah i won't be like recording a lot until like maybe february because that's when i'll be back at school with my tripod and i can like really record because i don't want to keep putting out videos where you can't even really see what i'm doing but I think the, the business card will fit better in this box because it's bigger. Let me see. I don't know why I keep trying to fit this in here. It doesn't matter. 
we're gonna go in after but yeah here's how this one looks I'll hold the glosses in place it's super cute and then just put the lip the lid why is the lid not going on okay and then this one comes like this so then we have our two packs i didn't realize that one of them was bigger like i literally thought they were the same size that shows how much i pay attention in the store okay so now let me show you because i don't feel like making the rest of these right now let me show you my rebranding stuff i'm not gonna necessarily tell you guys what i'm adding to the website because um you know people like steal people's ideas and i i mean i don't really is there there probably is someone that's gonna be selling the same thing i'm about to start selling but i don't want to tell anyone just so it won't be as many people come out of it because a lot of people have been just doing everything that everybody else is doing i'm like Everybody can't do the same stuff. Like, we're not going to make money. Well, I'm going to make money. But everybody's not going to make money if everyone's literally selling the same stuff everyone else is selling. That's why you got to be creative with your brand. Like, you got to spice it up. If you got to start putting, um, because I saw made by REJ. She has, like, this lavender lip gloss. And I've literally never seen anyone else do that. And I just feel like it's so cute because no one else has it. Okay. So, the new things I've came up with so far, the new things I'm new cards and stuff i made so far i've made a business card and a thank you card and i didn't have thank you cards before so that's low-key why i wanted them now because i was like i didn't have it before so let me have it now plus i'll be selling more stuff so it's gonna be cuter but i think i'm gonna change the colors because right now it's pink and black but my website's black and red but i don't want black anymore so i was thinking red white and gold those are probably cute together it just i have to find the right shade of red i'm looking for so this is how my business my um business cards look they're the credit card theme because i've i've seen them i saw maybe i already dated this i don't know anyone else i saw what's the credit card so debit here's card? the credit card debit card and it just says noise minx collection you know your credit card number it's valid through noise minx it's a glam card then you scroll down to the back of the card and that's how it looks if this will focus so we are going to be focusing more on wholesale next year like we are and then you know it just has signatures and our little information down there and i just thought this was like the cutest card ever like it's just really cute so let me show you guys the um the thank you cards Sorry, y'all finna see all the stuff I've been designing because I'd be designing a lot of stuff. I don't design my stuff on um Vistaprint. It's all on Canva. Canva is what you guys need to learn how to use because when I tell you Canva, you can do anything on there. Okay, so here are the, the front of the thank you card. It says, thank you for your purchase. Has contact information, blah, blah, blah. Our website. And then the back. Ooh. Tag us in your selfies. You know, picture of me, obviously. And it, whenever you buy something, it will come with a code. This code is not activated yet. So even if you're looking at it now and you try to buy something with the code, it's not going to work. Because it's not activated. Because I haven't shipped out any packages with this card yet. So it's not activated. And you know, it says you can use this code on your next purchase. Then we have a hashtag, hashtag noise makes because no one else has the hashtag. Hashtag us with the hash, hashtag us with the hashtag. Use the hashtag when you post a picture and you will be reposted on our Instagram page. So yeah, this is what I've been doing so far. Back to this angle. Okay, so yeah. The cards and stuff I came up with. And then, you know, as a business person, you should have a notebook. I just bought a cheap notebook from the dollar store because I don't need to buy an expensive notebook. People be buying expensive notebooks. I'm like, it's all just paper, so what's the point? But yeah. These are stuff that I plan on selling in 2020. Like, I made a whole list of stuff i'm trying to add to my website look i don't want to just be lip gloss and lashes and lip scrubs anymore i'm trying to be kylie cosmetics like that's what i'm trying to be but that's really my goal i really literally want to be like her like her business like she's a great businesswoman and like she's like all her makeup stuff is just really nice and i would like to be like that but something similar to that 
but i don't want to just focus on cosmetics kind of i kind of want to be like beauty like all around beauty like everything beauty not just like makeup stuff you know what i'm saying maybe i'll give y'all a hint but yeah so so far i like i made a like a list of stuff that i had to like do in order to make the new bag bag the new um my rebrand stuff so it's like that new logo i have to make a new logo i haven't done that yet because i really can't figure out what exactly i want for my logo like i literally have no idea what i want but we'll figure it out soon we're gonna we're gonna get it so yeah and i have to find new lash boxes and a lip gloss tubes i've kind of saw the tubes i'm considering but I don't know. The last boxes, I can't, I know I'm going to get a rectangle box. I just don't know, like, exactly if I want the cardboard boxes, like the cheap cardboard boxes, or, like, the the cardboard that's like this, but, like, rectangle. Because they have, like, the paper cardboard boxes, and they have, like, cardboard boxes like this, like the magnetic ones. I just haven't decided which one I want. I kind of want the um the paper ones because it's a lot cheaper like it's sort of like two cents per box and the cardboard ones are like 50 cents or like a dollar or something so it is a lot saving more money if i do the paper boxes but i just feel like um the cardboard ones are like more cute the paper ones are like the ones you see at the beauty supply store you get what i'm saying but i don't know because mocha p beauty she's like inspiration and bougie barbie and Oh, I said Aurora for life, something like that. These are like there's a lot of big people that do cosmetics, and it's like people only know the ones that do that do YouTube. But if you go on Instagram and you like look up like lip gloss vendors and stuff, like there's a lot of people that like have like 55k followers that are having cosmetics. It's just like because they don't have YouTube, a lot of people don't know about them. But there's one black girl I watch her like. But yeah, Mocha, she has like paper lash boxes, and her design is really cute. Just I don't really I don't know. I want a box, a cardboard box where you can't see the lashes like from the box. Like I like the idea of opening the box and you see what you're getting. So yeah, that's just me. That's kind of why I don't want the paper boxes because they all have like the peephole thing where you can see the lashes. And I don't know. I just, I like when you get the box, you open it and then you see the lashes. I don't really like when you're just looking at the lashes because it just reminds me of the beauty supply store. But yeah, that's just me. I'm weird. So yeah. Okay, so now since I've made up my, my things, I'm very happy now gonna take some product shots i'll probably like include the pictures in here since you know i got a new phone and the camera quality is just but yeah thank you guys for watching don't forget to like comment subscribe oh you guys code for today is um blowout like all capital letters because i'm currently having a blowout sale on my website I'm trying to get rid of all my inventory so i can come out with new inventory i don't have a lot of stuff left but nothing's really out of stock yet the only thing that's out of stock is my silk rose lip gloss i think i have one left then it'll be out of stock everything else i literally have like two of each thing left literally i'm almost sold out of everything so if you like to you know get yourself some lip glosses lip scrubs lashes stuff like that use the code blowout for i think 35 percent off of your order your entire purchase so use the code now and, you know support the dream support my dream this is literally my dream support the dream yeah, love you guys. Peace.